called your parents and told them to expect the worst. I'm never going to get out of here, am I? Oh, yes, you are. One stitch in the eyelid isn't enough to keep it here, you know. You're going home right on time. I am. Unless you're struck by lightning or something, which in your case I wouldn't rule out. Hi, Ruthie. You two have got to be good mates, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah, we have. Ruthie. Hey, she's saying something. Ruthie. It's your name. We got hold of an email from the car park company to Culver House. He's been secretly working for them. As well as for the hospital? Okay. That's... Terrible. Yeah. And that's why he wants to destroy the garden. Because the closer they build the car park to the hospital, the more money the car park company gets. And the more money he gets, right? Oh, no! Closed for maintenance. As if. Culver House must have realised the email went astray. But there's probably an everyday explanation as well. Cal, I believe you. Culver House is capable of anything. He asked my dad to keep me away from the demolition. All is not lost. I made a print out of the email. It's safe. We're going to have to choose our moment to use all this evidence, you know. Well, it's good to have, but... Sorry, I've got to say this. It's not the most important thing. But we can use the email and the tape to convince... Exactly. Convince who? Who's on our side? I'll find someone. Someone who we can trust. Good. But until then, we're going to take direct action. Agreed? Mum and Dad are waiting in reception. Sorry to dash, but I hate long goodbyes. See ya. Bye. See ya. Hi. Hi yourself. I'm proud of you. You did it. You faced your challenge. So did you. What? The radio. Being a DJ. Or did I dream that? Whoa. Here we go again. I'd like to thank all the doctors, nurses and patients for making this extended stay possible. Good luck and goodbye. See ya. She's dropping. She's cyanized. I'm up here. Shona! Shona! Robbie, she stopped breathing. If you want to help her, get out of the way. Pinpoint pupils. She's been given a massive dose of morphine. We need Narcan. Give ICU in. Tell them to come on. She's going to need intubating. Let's get her to ICU now. Mask. OK, ready? Ready. Go. Is she going to be OK? It's touch and go, Robbie. She's stabilised now. The Narcan's doing its job. As to the wider question... You mean, did somebody do this deliberately? Oh, come on, it's not likely, is it? These are kids we're talking about. I don't know about you, but I remember being a kid. I know how cruel they can be. Yeah, but really, would any of our kids, any of the kids on the ward, or even visitors? All right. We all know who the most obvious suspect is. So let's talk to her. I don't know what to say to you. I can't bring myself to shout. How could I scold you for trying to murder somebody? I was the one responsible for protecting Shona. You all may say you left her vulnerable for a moment, but the responsibility was mine. I didn't anticipate having to protect her from someone like this. Didn't do it. What? I didn't go near her! I wanted to hurt her, yeah. Lots of times, but I didn't! If you told me it was an accident or some sort of prank that went wrong, I might believe you, but this complete denial... This always happens. This always happens. 
It's always me. Whether it is or it isn't, it's always Tash! You needed to be Tash. Who would you blame if it wasn't? This is your fault. It's not my fault! You tried to murder somebody, don't you understand that? Didn't! I didn't, I didn't! Get out of here, Ruthie. This is no place for you now, love. Why can't you just say what you did? Because I didn't do it. I didn't do it. She did it. You evil girl, how can you? Max, stop. She's telling the truth. She didn't do that to Shona. It was me. Are you trying to protect her again? No. No, it was me. When Shona's diary went missing, everybody started searching for it. And I thought, why does everybody love Shona? What's so special about her? You were jealous of her? Yeah. Yeah, I was. But I'm sorry I did it now. I'm so sorry. And I did it for her. Because she asked me to prove I was a mate. I had to do it. I had to. So we're not going to let Tash in here again. We've contacted her parents and she's going to be offered psychotherapy. I don't know what's going to happen to her in the end, but she won't be able to work Shauna or you. But why aren't you punishing me? I did it. I hurt Shona. Tash pushed you into doing it, twisted your friendship, then used you to try and get away with it. You're not going to see her again, are you? No. But how can I make up for what I did and say sorry? You can't. At least not yet. Oh, it hurts. I'm sure it does. You've learned a very hard lesson. You'll keep that inside you. And because of that, I think you might grow up to be a better sort of person. One who takes responsibility for what they do. We can't take away all the pain. So keep some of that hurt inside so that you can learn from it. 